Hey there YouTube, this is JV111 here, and welcome back to another episode of Agrarian Skies. So last episode, we got all the way to the Noble, and we completed some other quests. Uh, so now we're going to try and get ourselves actually to the Imperial towards the end of this episode. Um, we need some more dirt from the looks of it, so let's go grab that. Excellent. And we're going to get ourselves set up on this guy. And a flower. Okay. So, we have the noble. The next one we need is... You should be happy. Why? Huh? Okay, I was gonna say, um, I'm pretty sure this should work in the rain. Okay. So we need the Majestic. And then we're just going to let this guy run his course. Until we get the, uh, the princess out of it. I really don't need this comma, I just realized. So you're actually going to go here. Oh, I didn't even check to see if it would actually give me what I wanted. Let's do that first. Holy crap, you gave me four. Damn, son. I'm going to be, uh, taking some things from, uh, your babies. And give me this. Give me this. Give me this. Do. The honeydews will also work in this case. We're at four percent complete on that honey thing. But yeah, so genetic template can actually go into the chest. Because once I get those babies, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get the uh, the ability off of them from multiple guys. And that's exactly what I'm going to want. Um, so now I'm just waiting for him to finish up, really. So let's see what else we can do while we're waiting for that. Because once we get that, we have the noble in our guy... So that'll give us the Imperial. I put this noble back over here. No. Go in here. So we'll have that guy. Guess what I'm gonna need to do is make another automation upgrade and lifespan. I figure out how to make a lifespan upgrade. I think I know how to make it. Okay, uh. If 
Fermented spider eye. That's creepy. Just gonna need to get some brown mushrooms again. No, I'm definitely gonna want to get into the other bees as well, so. We're probably gonna just plow through the bees for the next few episodes. <laughs> Uh, I might do a lot of the bees also off camera and show you guys uh, which ones I do. The ones I definitely want are the um, the metal bees, for sure. Uh, do I have a jaded? I don't know if I have a jaded bee. Let me see. Uh, it'd be very hard not to see the jaded bee. No, I don't. But one of the quests gives me a purple bee that I'm going to need. I'm going to have that thing go on just full freaking automated tilt. Uh, yeah. And that's what we need the royal jelly for so we can continue our progress through that. Uh, oh, that's what I'm going to do. Act. Yeah, so... Let's make the life thing first. That's one. And then the... No, it's automation. Oh, I needed... Eh. Make one from... Now, that. So, boom, boom. Uh, you're still going. So let's finish up the rest of that quest line that we needed. Bees and trees. Well, we're probably going to make this one afterwards. So once we get this, once we get this guy going, it's pretty much done for. Uh, blank gene sample. And there we go. Oh, easy peasy. What I'm going to do though, I'm going to get some more tin first because I want a stack of them. Not even close to a stack. Uh, dear. Okay, a little more than a stack. A huge problem. Because you're going to go in here for when I want to get the babies out of this guy. And that should be the last of that guy. And then that'll give me the Valiant and an Indexer. And the Indexer will be nice. So I can dump all the bees into the Indexer and get rid of these things. I don't know why I made them in the first place. I was dumb of me. You're making quite a bit of combs, and I'm very happy for that. Because that means that's a lot more products for me. Uh, yeah, you do what you gotta do. I'm at 6%. Yeah, seventy one percent. You're doing your thing. Definitely want a lot more commons, which would be nice. 
Because once I get to the industrious, I'm gonna want start wanting some of the other bees. Uh, this episode we might, yeah. This episode we're just gonna get into that. Uh, between next episode and various others, I will show you various progress. Because I know I'm gonna want like the iron bee and uh, yeah, any bee that gives me metals. I'm gonna want the diamond bee for sure. So I go to like B or diamond. Uh, I want the bee that gives me. So it gives me f shards. So I'm gonna want two. I'm gonna want the diamond bee. I'm gonna want the diamond bee. So I get the diamond bee. I need a lapis. I need an imperial. Lapis is a water and a resilient, and a resilient is an imperial and a robust, and a robust is a rocky and a tolerant. Tolerant is just all kinds of nothing fun. Oh, that's what I can do. Get some diligent bees going. You are going to be of use, common queen. So give me the other ones that I need. This is going to be semi-manual uh, for now. With a little bit of automation, not a whole lot. Only reason why I'm doing it this way for now is because I need to ensure that What I get is what I get, and just in case I don't dump into anything, into any chest I don't want it to be in. I'm just gonna do it like that, and see if it actually will flower and give me a bee or not, or one of those or not. Let's do this thing. I know I did say I was going to automate this. Um, yeah, I should probably do that. No, that'll be next. Th that'll be. Actually, I'll automate this off camera. Now that I'm thinking about it, it's going to take me a long time to get this together. And once it's ready to go, I'll show it to you guys. Won't be very difficult, and I'll like have. When you see it, you'll be like, "Oh, that makes a lot of sense." The way I did it. Uh, it's not gonna be like what generic B did. If you guys watch him, uh, it's like a barrel thing. It's just gonna be like a modular thing and does what it needs to do. Uh, come on, give me what I want. Okay. So then I needed. It wasn't a. Uh, the imperial I need. There we go. There we go. And it's noble and majestic. Do I have. Noble. Oh, I have a noble in there. Make me imperial. I have an imperial queen. What the hell are you like? Beatific effect. Ah. Okay. Well, you're going to go into here. Ah, uh, I derped. Put him in the wrong one. Oh well. Break you up. Do that. 
put you in there. Let's get that sampler that we need. Now, I'm curious about something. Can I... Yes, I can smelt them if I don't like them. Excellent. No. You go... Into here. Are you going to kill the bee, though? You kill the bead. Bee. Ooh, I did not think of this through. I may have to make new majestics. Because I did not think this through. Uh, let me just make a power furnace for over there. Oh, it's a redstone furnace. Speaking of redstone, yoink. Yoink. One, two. Pop this guy just right here. Let's see if we got any royal jelly from you. Yes, royal jelly. Let's complete that quest. Um, is it serum? That quest is now completed. So now we get some Valiant stuff and an Indexer and let's take that reward back. So now we can do the Genetic Manipulation 2 stuff. And I will actually... Yeah, let's actually do that right now. Just come to think of it. Oh, epic bag. <sighs> of course, it did that fucking sinking issue. Clay golem. Mm, yeah, kind of. Sort of good. You need power. Very interesting. Um, oh, I was gonna say, where's my wireless access terminal? 
going to So, if you need power, then we do this. <laughs> All right, so yeah, next episode what I'm going to do is I'm going to set it up so that way all my bees are in this bad boy. Ooh. What was that? Oh, <gasps> you have regen. I has plans for you, my friend. <laughs> I just thought of something. And it's kind of blood magic related. <laughs> Which is very good for, in my case. Alright, so. Let's get on to those other items that we need to complete. What time is it? And we're getting close. Let's see if we can complete them in record time here, guys. So, inoculator. Inoculator. Needs magma cream. One, two. Three, four, five. Needs an advanced genetic machine, which needs a genetic machine, which needs an APRS machine. Sturdy casing, and we need at least four of those. I figure. We need four basic circuit boards, so we're going to need some redstone. Go for a stack for now. We're also going to need some tin. That's one. Come on. That's two. That's three. That's four. One, two, three. Four. So 
So now I got the genetic machine I gotta make, or this one I gotta make, which is the enhanced circuit board. So I need. Wow. That didn't take long. Uh, let's go tin. Okay. So we got before we needed. Okay, now we got the inoculator. Check. Next. The purifier. Check. The gene pool. Ah, uh, the gene pool only requires one of the... Ah, oh, that sucks. So, I just need some more tin. Come on, buddy. There we go. Gene pool. Oh, no. You make gene pool and the synthesizer. Four. 
All right. Made that in record time, and my cat's going crazy again. It was just a detection task. Nice. So now I just got to make some of the alveary stuff, which we will do next episode for sure. Uh, hopefully it won't be too, too difficult. Um, I'm not going to put any of this stuff in quite yet, because I have a plan for the DNA and whatnot. So you can go right right there. Oh, wait. Here he has some of the stuff done. <laughs> uh, I love how that works out. So I need a couple more things for the alveary. And it's a greater bag. I'm not liking where this is going because I never get anything. I stand corrected. That's actually really good. <laughs> All right, let's just drop this guy into here. We're going to do a quick sweep. It gave me an extra princess. Nice. So, next episode, uh, we'll be uh, doing the alveary. In between that episode and next, I'm going to be working towards making more bees, getting more bee species flowing. Oh, sorry. Um, also, I will be working towards uh, getting the, uh, the dirt automated. It's not going to be too difficult for me. I know exactly what I'm going to do now. I'm actually just going to need a couple more barrels in order to get it done. Uh, but yeah. So, thank you guys all for watching. If you guys haven't done so yet, please like and favorite this, vis this video and any other videos you may have seen me make or even uh, star in. Also, please subscribe and follow me on Twitter. Twitter.com slash jthe111 the best way to know when I put out more videos. Also, if you're a new YouTuber, an up-and-coming YouTuber, a YouTuber that wants to grow past their current setup, uh, click the link in the description down below, thatjuice.com slash jthe111. Uh, that Juice is a sub-network associated with the Freedom Network. They're a great network for YouTubers to start with. Uh, they have a great community around them. They help me out. I'm trying to return the favor, and I want to help them out as well. So, do that if you guys need to. Other than that, thank you guys for watching again, and always, stay frosty.